Hey guys, this is Lydia Machová from uh, Slovakia, former organizer of the Polyglot Gathering. Have you been also looking forward to the Polyglot Gathering in Poland this year? I guess we all have. And then, unfortunately, the corona situation happened and we cannot meet live. But I was really excited to hear uh, that uh, Petr Balash and the rest of the organizing team decided to hold an online version of the conference. And I think this is really, really cool because uh, we can meet still. I mean, it's not the same as live, but we still can get in touch in some ways. We can hear interesting talks. Uh, I myself am going to have a talk for sure. Uh, there will be English, non-English talks, uh, tandem meetings, some informal sessions, some games. Um, I mean, they're coming up with a lot of really interesting stuff. So I just hope that you will not change your mind and you know forget about the Polyglot Gathering community this year because uh, it is going to happen just in an online version. And so I really, really hope that you will be there. The gr good news is that if you already bought your ticket, you don't need to do anything. You just need to let the organizers know. And um, you can keep your ticket for next year's event in Poland. And on top of that, you get the ticket to the online conference, to the online gathering for free, which is totally amazing, right? And um, I also want to tell you as a former organizer that uh, by uh, keeping your ticket, or by buying the online gathering ticket, if you decide to uh, join us now and you didn't buy your ticket before, uh, you not only sign up for a cool conference, online conference and a lot of interesting talks and meeting people, but you also show support to the whole organizing team. Because I can tell you as a former organizer that there is a lot of work going on behind the scenes and uh, the team has been working really hard in the past few months to prepare the whole conference, to, to make it happen. And then whether it um, happens or not, they have already put in all the work. So this can be quite devastating for organizers of events, uh, you know, the situation like the one with Corona. Um, so if you get your ticket to the online conference, you also show support to the organizing team so that future gatherings can happen in the future, which I think would be great because I think all of us who have been to at least one gathering uh, or polyglot conference or Langfest or any other polyglot events, we all know how amazing it is to meet up, to uh, meet fellow polyglots or language lovers and just, um, you know, find people who are similar to you, who like to nerd about languages and practice different languages. So uh, I would definitely love to keep this uh, thing going and to attend future events. Um, so I hope you are home, I hope you're safe, and I also hope to see you at the online Polyglot Gathering this year and then hopefully in Poland next year. See you there.